Good day everyone. Today we will teach you on how to choose and download the specific Adobe PySoft software that you will be using depending on what type of build and what type of license you have. First, we need to go to your browser and you need to type adopisoft.com. Once you reach the website, you will see that there will be a download option that is available at the home page. You need to click that one. You will then see that there are different types of software depending on what type of board you have. You will have to download the correct one because if you download a different one then it will not be compatible with the other boards. So please be aware of that. And for our video, our example would be on the Raspberry Pi since that is the type of board that we are using. We can now see that there are different types of Raspberry Pi and the models that are supported by this software is listed above. And in order to identify what type of license you have, whether it is a light or a business version, you just need to create an account on the website by using your email and creating a password since your license is always connected to your email. Once you have created your account, when you go to login, there should be a license key option on the left side and if you click that, the licenses that are attached to your email will be shown and it will also be labeled whether it is a light version or a business version. Now that we have identified what type of license you have, we will now go ahead and identify what type of build you have. First, with the villain setup, it should have an access point, a router, and then the board. Next, for the USB to LAN setup, it should have an access point, a USB to LAN connector, the board, and also the router. Almost the same, except for the USB to LAN connector. And for the third one, it is the built-in Wi-Fi only option, which takes advantage of the feature of the RPI that has a built-in Wi-Fi that the other boards doesn't have. And once we have identified what type of license and build you have, you can now go ahead and download the software. That's all for today. Thank you and see you next time.